Hi and welcome to this DCP web tutorial. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a photo album on your Facebook business page. So I'm going to go to my Firefox and I've got my Facebook business page load up and I'm going to click on share a photo video. I'm going to click, click on create a photo album. And this, In this example I'm actually going to use logo designs rather than real photos. You can use real photos or examples of your work. So I'm going to select all of these logos that I've designed and I'm going to click open and you have to be a bit patient because all these images have to be uploaded to Facebook. While it's uploading we'll try and give this a title here so you can see untitled album we're going to call it DCP example logo designs and you can pick a date so if, if this was an event that you was uploading photos for, you could pick a specific date. I'm just going to use today's date. You can say whether they're high quality or store large images. So it would be slower. So I'm going to let Facebook compress them and show store the smaller file sizes itself. Uh, you can write something about the album here as well. And if it was an event, you could say where it was taken. Uh, in this case, I'm not going to do that. You can also when these have been uploaded you can also reshuffle them and change the ordering so if you want to show let's say for example this one higher up in the ordering you can just drag and drop them and reposition them on the screen I think we'll have this one first and that's how you create the actual album you click on the post button here And Facebook will take you directly to that album that you've just created so you can see example logo designs and if you're not happy with something you can go in and edit or remove them from here you can click on this drop down menu here and you can delete the album you can delete specific photos you can change the ordering you can download the album if you want uh, you can add photos from another page as well to the album you can get a direct link to the album as well if you want to share it on your other social media networks so if we go back to our timeline here you can see the photos but here you can see the actual post of the album here and if, you, if I were to click on this album it will load up and show the images you can see the quality is okay it's pretty decent it's good enough to just show as example logos and then people can comment and message here so I hope you find that useful and I'm going to take a little look and um, go through some of the other options in this share photo and video section here. Okay, I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial.